Feed me, Spartas. The sacred gates of Sumeru open up. Don't move, Deva. I will not let you bring your fiery army in here. <laughs> and who's going to stop me? You little nothing. Keeper here, the town can sleep peacefully. I will be back. Helena, don't get so upset. We'll find your bracelet. Anything? Nothing, girls. The Mirror of Prophecy didn't say anything useful about the bracelet. <sighs> the Wood Sprite doesn't know anything. Helena, don't be so sad. Your bracelet will definitely show up. But for now, look! You like dancing, right? Well, tonight, the park will be hosting this big dancing competition. You need a distraction, so I signed up all of us. Snowy! How can you talk about dances? I'm not going anywhere. <laughs> That's a wise choice. Better drop out from the start. You should see what Cody and I prepared. We are so gonna win. And why do you think that, I wonder? We would totally outdance you two, hands down and eyes closed. Hey, you shouldn't mess with her. Hmm. We'll see about that. See you at the dancing floor. Snowy? When exactly does the competition begin? Welcome to the Heroes of Earth HQ. Here I have a telescope, some aliens' portraits. This one is from Enceladus. I need the drawing. <laughs> I can tell. Listen, I think this is the perfect place where we can test this. What's that? A girl's bracelet? This isn't just a girl's bracelet, Cody. It's magical, and in a moment, it's gonna turn me into a real wizard. Watch me! Nothing? That's strange. I must have put it on the wrong side. There we go. Now look what happens. Alex, listen, it's nothing personal, but it's the final tournament of the chess club in half an hour. I've been preparing for it for six months. <sighs> Fine, Cody, go already. All right, then, I'm off. Just pull down the hatch when you leave. See you tonight. Hmm, maybe I'm supposed to press something? Whoa! Uh. Fire, fire, let the fire in. Ugh, this place gives me the creeps. Ah, ha, there you are. Did I really get it wrong and this is nothing more than just some kind of shiny girly trinket? Whoa! 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 Unbelievable, I made it work. Okay, we'll continue this at the dance. Well, here I come, fairies. We are now on equal terms. Ooh, I'm not late. Can you believe it? I actually won the final game. Well, almost. Hand me my fireballs. Oh, I think I forgot to bring them. You forgot to bring over my fireballs? Is there no brain in that head of yours? Huh? Oh, what? What's going on? Let's go. Look at how awesome we are! 
way cooler than that Alex Lewis boy. By the way, can't see him anywhere. He probably chickened out and didn't come. <laughs> oh, there they are. They came after all. I've been waiting for this moment for so How long. How is he doing that? Mine now. It looks like it's some kind of magic. Is my Helena, and I'll tell you something, I think lad. he's wearing your bracelet. Magic is my passion. Magic is my thing. I have only one confession. I just want to be the king. Not again. What is he doing? No. Without a doubt, this is the Phantom. <laughs> what? Who dares to interrupt my performance? The show has to continue! Here comes my day, here comes my hour. The vicious flames will give me What? What was that? I didn't know the Phantom wields the magic of fire. Or this is not the Phantom. Magic is my passion, magic is my thing. Unbelievable! This is the fiery Deva! I need to run straight to Fableton and get my magical sword! Dare you get in my way? I am the best! What's going on? I didn't mean to. No! It looks like something happened to Alex. Oh, where's Helena? Stop resisting me. Surrender your will. No! You need to go back to the cellar and let in the fiery army. No! I don't wanna! <laughs> Who are you trying to lie to? I can see. I see vanity. You want to be a wizard. You desire fame. I can give you all of that. Surrender to me! No! Aha! I got you! Elena! I'm sorry. I... I just wanted to become a wizard. Like you. What have you done to my bracelet? You dirty thief! How dare you, silly girl! Hey! What's going on? No! Don't do it! Leave her alone! I'll do anything you want! Helena! Helena! Are you okay? And where's Alex? I don't think that was the real Alex. Peterson, start explaining what happened to him. And how would I know? At HQ today, he was playing with some bracelet. And then I went to the chess club and... Cody, where's your HQ? Hyper Portes. The gates to the world of fire open. Fantasy Patrol, you need to stop right now. <laughs> you can never stop the fiery Deva. My powerful army is coming. Genie, he's taken over Alex. And how are we supposed to stop him? It says here that we shouldn't make him angry. Anger only makes Deva stronger. All right. In that case, I'm gonna go try and talk to him. Helena, come back right now. Alex, it's me. I know you can hear me. Easy, easy. Everything's okay. Alex, I know that you really wanted to become a w w wizard. Why you took my bracelet. I get it. I was a regular girl my whole life. But you, you are a great guy without any magic. Remember that awesome fire show you did at the Magicians and Illusionists competition? That was without magic. I could never do that. And this evil is in the bracelet. Take it off, and then I'll be able to help you. Aha! I got you now, Deva! <laughs> and this time, I will make you go away! Fantasy Patrol! become a proper wizard, but I won't let you hurt her! You hear me?
Helena, please forgive me for the bracelet, if you can. And thank you for saving me. <laughs> Don't mention it. That's our job, after all. We are the Fantasy Patrol. <laughs> Speaking of Fantasy Patrol, Alex, swear that you'll keep everything you saw today a secret. I swear. Not a word to anyone. No one's gonna believe it anyway. By the way, do you maybe need some help? Obviously, I'm not a wizard, but... We do. There's one job perfect for you. and surrounded by its elements. Only to the bearer of matching power, it will reveal itself. In a case? But where are we supposed to find that case? Sparkling pillar from out of nowhere, that flies away we do not know where. With bare hands you cannot hold it, but it's afraid of solid ice. So we got ourselves another puzzle. I thought the mirror would simply tell us where to find the keys. I think we should drop by the antique store. The brothers have all kinds of stuff there. Hey, hey, hey! The annual party at the Magical College, a costume competition, and a lot of dancing. Oh, and prepare a cool dance routine. <laughs> a party for the wizarding folk? That is so awesome! Hey, can I come with you? Pretty, pretty, please. Sure, you can come. Oh, we're gonna need to choose a costume. Girls, remember our first homecoming after graduation? We had an oven race that time. It was so much fun, and Mary fell down from her oven! <laughs> and remember how we all agreed to come to the reunion in the costumes of forest fairies, and Mary dressed up as a tree? It was a dryad costume. And what about our secret greeting? Remember, girls? The one we made up ourselves? Jump, turn, clap! That's right, and Mary would always... Fall down while turning. Ha ha ha! Very funny. Oh, come on, Mary. It was so much fun. You know what, girls? You can go if you want, but there's no way I'm going to this party. Hey! Do you maybe have something that would suit me? Like a phoenix or something? <laughs> Mary, where are you going? To the store. I'm gonna look for the case. Since the girls are gonna spend hours dressing up anyway. Get out! Oh, Mary! Come on in! <laughs> and where are your friends, eh? Saving the town as always? No, actually, they're getting ready for the homecoming party, and I... Came to get a dress? I have one that'll look great on you! Here! Uh, thank you, but that's not why I came. Come on, just look at it! You'll be the dancing queen! I wanted to ask you about a case. A case? Sure, we have lots of those! <laughs> I'll go get them now! Meanwhile, you can try on the dress! It's for free! And Mary dressed up as a log! <sighs> okay, I'll just try it on. The Phoenix costume! And what about the hat? Or at least some kind of...
kind of feathers? Helena, there's no hat. That's all right. My grandma has this feathery thingy. It's gonna fit perfectly. I'm gonna go home and get it. Be back in a jiffy, girls! Oh, Mary, that was quick. Helena, I learned everything about your parents. Come with me. What about the girls? Let's go. We don't have time to waste. Hey, Tweedledum. Do you remember that today at the fountain in the park there's a homecoming party of the Magical College alumni? I do. <laughs> we should go there. Crap. Crack, 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 crack. Crack. A library? Come on, we need to hurry. Get out of my way. So what did you find out? Venus in Aquarius, Mars is closing in on the fourth planet. All right, it's looking good. What is looking good? Here, see? Mystic ruins. All we need to do now is decipher them. Helena, I need your bracelet. from the third shelf. Which book? This one? Ah! One and two, one and two, and a turn. Hey! Quack. What a cute froggy. Such a pretty little Quack. thing. That's strange. Quack, Quack. Where did it come from? You are gonna be our audience. Don't turn it off again. One, two, three, let's go! Come on, Froggy. What are you doing? I am Mary. I was transformed into a frog. Please change me back. Mary? Mary, is that you? Change her back? But how? Snowy, you've never read any fairy tales? To change a frog back, it has to be kissed by a prince. Only where can we get one? Hey, girls! I'm ready! How do you like my costume? Just perfect. There's our prince on a white horse. I don't know. One piece of cheese is not a lot. How can you say that? This is Mary, our friend! All right, all right, I'll do it. What if it's not really Mary, but just a disgusting toad? Hooray! It worked! Mary? What happened? There! I tried on a frog's dress for a minute, only it turned out to be a trap! Crack. Uh, I'll, I'll tell you about it later. Girls, Helena's in danger! Mary! Help me! Come on, you gotta get me out of here! <laughs> Silly little girl, still haven't realized who I am? I have the key now, and you'll become nothing but a pale spark. Right on time! We won't let you get away with it, Phantom! And we're not afraid of you! Because we are... Fantasy Patrol! <laughs> what can you do to me, Fantasy Patrol? If 
She fell asleep. <laughs> and you, Green? She's too much food. <sighs> huh? I did it! I got one! think about eating ice cream. Well, I don't know about aliens, but I would love to have one right now. Creme brulee would be great. Creme brulee? That's my favorite, too. You just don't go anywhere, okay? I'll be right back. I'll be quick. One moment. He's <laughs> <laughs> such a funny guy. There. I don't even have a blaster. What should I do? Helena, I can't believe it. Five hot dogs in one sitting. That wasn't me. Hey, you. Come here and hurry. This is where she was dragged to. I wanted to go in, but my mom doesn't allow me to climb into wells and pits. Okay, all right. Entry 37. Snowy was kidnapped by dwarves. The question is why? We need to figure it out. Let's go. And me? What should I do? And you, Peterson, stay here. Guard the hole. Here. This is also for you, Your Majesty Snowy White. Thank you, kind dwarves. The gems are really pretty, but I'm not Snow White. 
I'm simply Snowy. Oh. Your Majesty, please don't go. Stay here with us, kind Snowy White. We really, really like you. <laughs> Dear dwarfs, I cannot stay here. But maybe you can be our guest for just a little bit. Pretty, 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 please. <laughs> All right, dear dwarfs, I will stay with you till the evening. This place looks nice. And what is this? Oh, this is the royal ruby. The biggest and most beautiful ruby in the world. In the past, it used to be the most important treasure of our kings. But then it disappeared. We've been looking for it ever since. But we still cannot find it. Oh, wow! This is what I call a big cave. Fellow walked along the road, and then he saw a piece of gold. He bought a violin and a bow. Dance now, snowy, dance now. <laughs> oh, what is that? That's uh, nothing important. Something must have broken in the tunnel. We're going to fix it. Snowball by Bunny Lip. He loved his mistress, oh, so what? Bunny is cute, Bunny is cute. Dance now, snowy, dance now. Bearded creatures. This is King Glom the Third. Helena, actually, we came here to rescue Snowy. Quiet. Do you hear that, girls? Aha! Dwarves! <laughs> you have kidnapped our Snowy. Tell us where she is this instant. Uh, it wasn't us. It's all those pestilent miners. What miners are you talking about? We saw them dragging away this little girl. She had blonde hair. If you want, we can show you the way. And you guard the hole. You think I'm a coward? No. Cody Peterson will show you what he can do. The hero of Earth. Let's go. <laughs> There, we've arrived. The miner's cave is at the bottom. This way. Wow, that is really deep. Thank you. Helena, you should go first. Oh, I can't see anything. <laughs> hey! <laughs> you two-faced liars, ugly, wicked dumplings. You're gonna pay for this! <laughs> This place must be an abandoned mine. Oh, right, all right, all right. There has to be a way out. Oh, Valerie, do you think that you could maybe teleport us out of here? No, Helena. Teleportation doesn't work underground. No, but that means that we're going to be stuck in this place forever. <laughs> Calm down, Helena. I've got an idea. Mine carts. They can take us out. We just need to get this gate to open. And how are we going to get it open? We need to fire up this boiler. not working at all. Mary, you have the key of the earth. <laughs> That's right! Come on, tell these stupid stones they need to move. Okay, I'm gonna try. This is an underground alien base, and these are definitely their leaders. <laughs> hmm, and what is this thing here? I bet it's something extraterrestrial. Oh, 
You? Peterson? What are you doing here? I came here to save Snowy. Just look at this savior. It's ending. Oh. Thank you, dear dwarfs, but I should go. Huh? Oh, lovely Snowy White, why don't you stay with us a little longer? Huh? Huh? <sighs> well then, the wish of our queen is our command. If you want to go home, we'll show you the way. Get away from me! We arrived. Yeah, and apparently it's the final station. <laughs> I've got you now, you dirty liars. You're going to regret what you've done. Start telling us where Snowy is. Her Majesty Snowy White is ours. You will never be able to find her. No one can find a way out of our caves. <laughs> there has to be something we can do. I have an idea. All right, girls. Give me all the valuables you've got on you. These are dwarves. They'll give up everything for shiny trinkets. Here, we're exchanging these treasures for our Snowy. <laughs> <laughs> this is what you're calling treasures? Oh, this is worthless trash. Here, to save Snowy, I will do anything. <gasps> is this really the royal ruby? We've been looking for you for centuries. You've, You've returned, returned to us. us. Not so fast. How about first you give us our Snowy? <laughs> Regret what you've done! Peterson, swear that you won't talk to anyone about what you saw. I swear. No one will believe me anyway. All right. We should go now, girls. Snowy! I wanted to ask, can extraterrestrial girls be friends with boys from this planet? Extraterrestrial? <laughs> but of course, Cody. <gasps> Thank you for your help. <sighs> All right, it was somewhere here. Huh? All right, all right. Here it is, the water of life. Okay, a drop of living in the darkness of night. A spark of consciousness in the toy light. Oh! And it worked. Let's see, come over here.
thought I'd managed to conjure today. <laughs> Helena, come on! This is a fireling. It's dangerous. This is not a fireling. This is a fire cat. And from now on, it's my pet. And there's nothing dangerous about it, but it's very, very cool. <laughs> Drakey, stop it now! Stop! Yeah, Helena, you're right. Very cool. Mmm, creme brulee, my favorite. I'm sure the girls will love it. Wow, musicians. <laughs> Hello, snow maiden. Tweedledee? Me? <laughs> you got it wrong. Neither Tweedledee. No, Tweedledum. Don't do anything rash, Snow Maiden. I have a surprise for you. Bunny? Alive? Yes, I brought him to life. And unless you bring the magical keys to the abandoned toy factory, you will never see your bunny. Pillow fighting. <laughs> Take this! Uh, uh, no way, Valerie! Using magic is against the rules. Well, I'm gonna teach you a lesson. Yeah. Ow! You're behaving like kids! Ow! I'm not gonna let this slide. Uh, uh, ow! Take this! <laughs> <laughs> hey. Join us! Oh. Hey, go away! Valerie, do something about this big eater! He's got his paws on the cake! Oh, the cake! Drakey, go to your place! Helena, shall we go set off some fireworks? Any cake? Pretty. Okay, do it, Helena. It's a good time to see you launch those magical sparks. Okay, one sec. Oh, I forgot to sample to my purse. <gasps> my poor bunny. Oh, I love you so much. But if I give the keys to the phantom, Helena will never be able to go to the fairy tale world and find her parents. No, I cannot do it. Bunny, I will save you myself. Snowy, are you serious? You really wanted to go fight the Phantom on your own? And you thought we'd let you go alone? Oh, girls, I'm so sorry, but he's got my bunny. Wait, what bunny? Snowy's bunny. Cheer up. We'll get him back. Do you roger me, girls? I'm at the place. How's the picture? Snowy, the picture's good. You can go in, but be careful. Can't see anyone so far. <gasps> Bunny! So, Snow Maiden. <laughs> As you see, I kept my word. But do you have the keys? Yes, I do. Here! Put them in here. Snowy, try to find out where the Phantom's hiding. He must be somewhere close. Where is he? Where is he? Aww, we're gonna lose our keys! It looks like there's some movement on the right side. Snowy, turn around. That way. Let's teleport there. Grab it! Helena, catch! Take this, Phantom! No one's here. So where's the Phantom? She obviously got scared and ran away. That's strange. I didn't expect it to go this easy. My bunny! Ding, ding. 
Tricky, what are you doing? This is my bunny. Tricky, hush. Go to your place. Come on, Tricky. Don't be jealous. I love you just as much. It's so strange. The bunny's alive now. Where have you been all this time? Quite a traveler. Thank you so much, girls. You don't know how happy this makes me. Okay, missies, let's start tea partying already, because uh, I'm getting very sleepy weepy. <laughs> Bring them to me. Bring me the bracelets. just sleep at night. First, they bring home pets, and now I'm the one who has to look after this bunch of weird creatures. <laughs> Finally! The keys are mine! <laughs> Get away from me, you flying piece of lizard! Drakey, I guess I should start working on making you a real fighter dragon. <laughs> Bunny, what's wrong with you? It looks like your bunny has been bewitched. <laughs> Okay, all right. The siren's magical ribbon, capable of taking the free will from any creature. Powerful thing. Ah! And now it's gone. This powerful thing. <laughs> uh, come on. Our home has become some sort of magical zoo. <laughs> It all comes together. The prophecy is coming true. The descendant of the great wizards is here. Barbara, I think that you are wrong about this. Ginger hair, feisty character, it's definitely her. Hmm. This is what we're going to do.
magicians and illusionists. A talent show for children. Girls, guess what? I'm gonna be there too! I got an invitation yesterday. How do you even find time for all this? Hey, girls! There's this guy, and he's doing things with fire. Come, see for yourself. Check it out. Cool, right? It looks like real magic of fire. You call this magic? I can do better. People, make way now. Oh, I met you, and everything that was before will burn in my palms. Lewis, Alex. Just what I thought, Pushkin. Watch and learn how it's done, poets. Helena, don't you dare. Did you forget the rules? You shouldn't play with fire, baby. But don't be sad. Enjoy a candy. Oh, you don't know who you're messing with, Alex Lewis! Oh, Helena, come on! Calm down now! Hey, give it back! I will when you cool down. Hurry up, we're gonna be late for the test. So... Who's a girl stalker here? Uh, I'm not a stalker. Are you new here? My name is Cody. Alex, so this gingerhead is always so... strange? Strange, you say? Why do I tell you what I know about them? Uh, let's go. The chem teacher doesn't like you when we're late. Outrageous! What a careless thing to do! Organizing a contest while the Phantom is at large! He'll definitely go there. <laughs> Not this. I guess I am our last hope. I have to get into this talent show. No, none of this will do either. I just need to disguise myself. <gasps> and what's this? Uh, uh, That's perfect! Exactly what I need! I don't believe any of that, Cody. It's the truth, I swear! You don't know the things they can do! They can make the wind come and go, or freeze things, or even burn everything! Bottom line, they are definitely aliens. Uh, Cody, aliens don't exist. Of course they are aliens! I've even set up a resistance squad! Heroes of Earth! Are you gonna join? Okay, I'll join you, but I'm gonna need one favor. Do you have any plans tonight? Please welcome! The next boy to come on stage is... Who? Alex Lewis? A famous magician! Where did he even come from, this show-off? Aha! Uh -huh. I haven't seen him in our town before. Ah, if I only had my prophecy stone with me. <laughs> you call this a magician? That settles it! The Phantom! <laughs> Finally, I got you! I need to sneak into his lair. That's not bad. That's not bad at all. Don't make rush decisions, Koshe. Helena's performance is coming up next. <laughs> That's your cue. We'll be in the audience. Helena, you're gonna do great. Mary! Hey, you forgot your purse! Oh. What a surprise. The goddess of fire herself. You know that victory is already mine. Oh, 
right, keep going, poet. Heroes of Earth! <gasps> the victory's already mine. Blah, 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 blah. Well, we'll just see about that, won't we? Let's give it up for our special girl! Our most incredible and well-loved Helena! Okay, you win. Please forgive us. We broke the rules. Yeah, we used our magic. It's all my fault. Mine and mine alone. Yes, but we'll get to that later. Do you know what this is? This is... This is a magic bracelet, right? This is more than just a magic bracelet, Helena. This is the key of fire. It is one of the four ancient keys that opened the portal to the fairy tale world. Only one person has the power to control it. A descendant of the great wizards of fire. So it means that... It means that I'm a descendant of fire wizards? But where are my parents? Your parents are in the fairy tale world, and the only way to get there is by collecting all four keys. You are a wonderful team. You can make it happen. Koshe and I will be there for you. Quiet. Well, have you seen them at the talent show? There's no doubt. They are aliens. <laughs> no, Cody. I don't think they're aliens at all. What they are is 100% real witches. She found herself a toast filled in a snap. Simply extraordinary. It's not usually very scary. Maya, Nick, Bia, 
and Bo, Puffy and Sonia. Sonia from Toastville. Uncontrolled evolution. Hey, Toast fans. I spent a long time in front of the mirror recently, and I stopped loving what I saw there. So it got me think about how to improve myself. Until that is, me and Bo gave me a call. On this shell phone thingy they gave me, they said their uncle too invented it. Oh no, me and Bo, I need your help. Coffee Super sat and self-conscious about how super clumsy he is. Now he's locked himself in. I won't talk to anyone. It sounded like Muffy needed some serious cheering up. And banana chips are the most cheerful snack there is. Toastville time for Sonia. They always cheer me up. Gross! Only boiled onions can cheer me up, but I doubt they will. Mm, okay, we can all make you some. Forget it. I'm so clumsy, I'd probably ruin the onions too. <laughs> Do you know why Muffy is so down? Oh, he knocked over a big shelf of soda pop in the store yesterday. <gasps> Clumsy that no one will ever love me. Oh, why did I have to be born an awkward muffin and not like a beautiful grace bird? Oh, Muffy really needs our help. Oh, I've got an idea. Hey, didn't you just tell me your uncle too invented an evolutionator? Uh -huh. Oh, yeah. Hey, Muffy, should I evolutionate up some boiled onions for you? Uncle Two's lab is really cool. Is that the evolutionator over there? Yes. So any object can be put through a series of changes to turn into something new. Yeah, Uncle Two calls it nearly controlled evolution. Wait, so why nearly? Because the result is so unstable. See this garlic? Look at it change. Let's turn it into an orange, for example. Enter the command for evolve in the emitter. <gasps> Fascinating, so fresh. Mm. 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 Tastes like an orange. Oh, it turned back to garlic. See, we told you the results were so unstable. Yeah, you have to eat it quickly before it returns to its original state. Oh, uh, we'll make it work. I promised you boiled onions, Muffy, so here goes. That's the only reason I came. Right. Here's the boiled onion. The chain is formed and evolved! <laughs> Where's your onion? Oh. oh, this is the best boiled onion I've ever had. Wow, can I have another go? I'll evolve this shoe into ice cream. Evolutionate. <laughs> It's still experimental. It could malfunction sometimes. Oh, but now we've got a lovely vase. Muffy, fill it with nice flowers and give to Maya to apologize for spraying her with soda yesterday. Oh, I know. It's no use. I'm such a clumsy clutch, really. Who could love me? Who could why me? Oh, wait. If it's possible to improve things with this, why not use it on Muffy to make it better? I don't think that'll work. Well, I sure do. I'll do anything to stop being so clumsy. Oh, so you want to be a bird for real then? You can try it since it's temporary. I set the final stage at Seagull. <laughs> the important 
important thing is to not get stuck midway. Launching the evolution process. Oh, wow! Oh, Fluffy, seriously, now you've got wings! A few more steps in! Oh, no, it's not a fly stage. Oh, uh, okay, we'll fix it. Oh, no, why, why me? Fluffy, don't panic, just give us a second to reboot it. Oh, what is that lovely stench, nasty, disgusting smell that I clearly deserve? Muffy, stop! It's working again! We can finish your evolution! No! I'm such a disgusting fly, forget it! I belong on burnt lands and the land of once in cheeses! Muffy! Wait! I'm gonna need wings to catch him. So yeah, you sure? It's too racy? No kidding. Hit, dude. Uh, oh, it's so heavy. Well, I'll just have to bring Muffy to. And delicious. Muffy, please come back. We all love you just the way you are. Yeah, well, whatever. Pass me that piece of cheese over there. We gotta hurry. If the evolutionator shorts out good, we'll both be stuck as flies forever. Maybe I want to be a fly forever. That's all I deserve now. moment when you are you. Good advice there, Muffy. You should tell yourself that more often. Home time for Sonya Fly. Uh, home time for Sonya. <gasps> See you, Tustians. Oh. That means you're cool after all, Muffy. Oh, me a cool have such a cool friend as Sonia. Yeah, that's so right. Mmm. It's not worth improving on something that's already pretty well made, that's for sure. After all that evolution, I'm pretty happy to be the way I am.
And do you go from Berlin? <laughs> yeah, ever since I came back, I'm so craving that stinky cheese. <laughs> hmm. I'm up. See ya. Bye bye. Money go fly. Please tell me why you make me cry. Money go fly. Don't break my heart. Stop drink my blood. Money go fly. Goodbye and zap, she found herself in Toastville in a snap. Toast me. Simply extraordinary. Toast me. It's not usually very scary. Toast me. Maya, Nick, B and Bo, Muffy and Sonia. Toast Sonia me. from Toastville. Looking good. Hi everyone. The other day we're supposed to get our pictures taken for the school yearbook and I wanted to look perfect. But then... Everyone gets pimples. Your friends don't care what you look like. They love you just the way you are. Oh, why do bad pimples happen to good people? Hey, I know who can help me. Toastville time for Sonia. I'm trying to get old Nick there to notice me. Hey, Nick. What's up? Huh? Hey, check it. <laughs> but he totally doesn't get it. That new makeup can help you catch his eye and to help me cover up this massively disgusting, enormous zit. Come on. And we've got something to help, too. <laughs> Maya, you're a pro at this. So finding zit hiding makeup for me will be a breeze. You have a zit? Look, oh, you can barely see it. You what? No, it's ginormous. Oh, I really need to get some makeup. Okay, let's find something. Hey, hey, check out the amazing cool powder. Everything that's ugly and ignored instantly looks pretty. I guarantee it. Oh, that's perfect. We'll just press by now. But. <laughs> <laughs> this cool powder would make my gross ginormous ugly to disappear. Like a real movie star. Yeah? Well, let me try some. So maybe if you want to look good, you need to powder yourself a lot. Oh. Oh. <laughs> You're so pretty. Oh, Sonia. Maya, you look so pretty. Now it's you that looks pretty. And my gross zit? It's gone! <laughs> Let's test it on my neck. <laughs> Those ridiculous toastians will help us carry out our genius plan. Why are you 
two being oh, so weird. Guy. Oh, oh, oh. Oh. Ew, Nick, you're totally stinky and gross. <laughs> <laughs> I know. Isn't it awesome? Whoa, he seemed so beautiful a second ago. Then the cool powder got washed off. So if I put it on Nick, he'll think I'm so cool and pretty. <coughs> oh, yeah. Hey, Nick. Over here. Okay, Nick. What do you see? Oh, my. You are so cool. Amazing. Cool powder really works. Oh, oh and she's even more. Hey, wait up. What's your name? Nick, you're supposed to look at me. Wait for me. You're a rascal. You're so smart. You're very cute. Hey, Nick, come here. Whoa, are you two in a band? You even look better than the Happy Stone. We do. <laughs> <laughs> Our cool powder is working even better than we thought. He thinks that we're pop stars. <laughs> oh! Can I get your autograph? <laughs> we got something even bad for you. Want to be part of our stage crew? <gasps> <gasps> you betcha! How can I help? You can join the crew setting up our concert. And this is a massive, cool special effect. Wow! Yeah, and if you do a good enough job, we might let you join our cool band, too. Just raise and rotate this puff of everyone! Awesome! Your concert's gonna blow toast for mine! <laughs> <laughs> You know it. <laughs> you got that? Huh? Huh? <laughs> yeah, hey, what are you doing? Get down, quick! The man! The man! We want the man! <laughs> Once those fills puffed with enough of our cool powder, they'll see our wrecking crew as artists decorating the town instead of trash kids. Hey, Toastbill, are you ready to rock? I said, are you ready to rock? Meddling toast saving ruined everything for us. I know, but we'll get our revenge. Get him! Go away! <laughs> oh. Oh. I'm really, real sorry, guys. Everything looked so amazing and awesome and cool. 
I couldn't solve myself. Don't feel so bad, Ick. It's our fault for using the cool powder on you in the first place. Yes. See, uh, I just want to look good in your eyes. Hey, you always look good, Maya. I do? Yeah. So, um, <clears throat> we should probably clean up Toastville, don't you think? Did you hear that? Oh, my Nikki says I always look good. Oh, trust me, my bestie. Nick's right. Uh, well, I hope you can manage to clean up without me. <sighs> Home time for Sonia. It's so much better for you to see things as they are, you know, rather than what they seem to be. And after all these terrible events, my pimples seem to be just a teeny tiny little problem. A day later, it was gone. And to Olga from Oslo. Crumble singing sound like a variegated chabara that got its tail caught in a blender. <laughs> I'm out, see ya, bye bye! Shot in the